Hi everybody, Dr. Justin McCormick here again with you guys. Today I want to talk about what is fibromyalgia. Now I know most of you have been told uh, by your doctors and rheumatologists that um, this fibromyalgia condition is, you know, it's just a muscle problem or you know, it's in your joints and you just need these pain medications or, or maybe it's just in your head and you just need to exercise more. You know, I hear these stories all the time. I'm going to talk about it from a neurological level. Every patient that we see has some sort of stress that triggered this outbreak of fibromyalgia and chronic pain. That stress could have been a car accident, a work accident, could have been an emotional trauma that you had at some point in your life. That stress, that overabundant stress, causes a release of cortisol into the brain. That cortisol is okay for a very short period of time, but in the long run it's toxic to the brain and it causes it to malfunction. Now, when that happens, the brain misfires and it leads to painful symptoms among many other things that most fibromyalgia patients suffer from. What is fibromyalgia? We deal with this from a neurological level where an area, a system of the brain, and we call this the neocortical thalamal hypothalamal pontomedullary reticular activating system. It's a big long word saying messages from the brain go to this part of the area, uh, part, of the, part of the brain, and then control and regulate it. Now, our technology is designed to repair those areas of the brain that aren't working properly. So there's fibromyalgia in a gist. We're looking for this on a neurological level and we want to repair this problem, not just cover it well, with more pain medications. So thanks for watching this uh, video and I hope this helps you.